top story tonight at 6. Bibb County Sheriff's deputies are trying to figure out why a part of Interstate 75 is the backdrop of several deadly crashes. The latest accident happened on I-75 South right after the Sardis Church Road exit. 41 NBC's Edna Reese talked to deputies about the deadly crash and what you can do to prevent an accident from happening. Edna. Michael, the Bibb County Sheriff's Office says that area has been proven to be very dangerous. They're not exactly sure why, but Captain Brad Wolf tells me there have been numerous accidents near that exit, so he wants you to be careful. Why that's such a dangerous area, we really haven't been able to pinpoint it yet. Another accident leaves one person dead on I-75 South near Sardis Church Road. The tractor trailer was stopped on the side of the road. Uh, the other vehicle came along and hit that that tractor trailer. Monday night, two men were driving down I-75 when the driver lost control, hitting a tractor trailer and killing 27-year-old Jacavis Hayward. The person was ejected and lost their life, but as far as anything beyond that, I really can't tell you much more right now. Uh, they're still currently, as we speak, investigating the crash. But what Captain Brad Wolf with the Bibb County Sheriff's Office can say is this isn't the first crash to happen in that same area. It seems so wide open and flat and plenty of visibility and all that, so exactly what's making that such a bad area, we're not exactly sure yet, but we're going to be trying to figure it out. In the meantime, Captain Wolf suggests you be vigilant. And be aware that is an area that's susceptible and prone to accidents for whatever reason. We see a large number of accidents there extra cautious. And Captain Wolf says if you see someone pulled over in the emergency lane, move over if you can. If not, slow down. The Sheriff's Office also recommends that if you have to pull over, put on your hazard lights on and stay away from the road. Michael? Well, in September, another man was killed while getting out of his car in that same area on I-75 after Sardis Church Road. Thank you, Edna.